Chapter 9 Learning the Ropes I remember one notable disciplinary hearing being called way back at journalism school. The atmosphere in the meeting was tense. From next door there was a distinctive flush. And before you knew it, Paxman was... <laughs> before you knew it, Paxman was stepping out of the laboratory and into the room where we all sat, shivering. He'd been gone for a full... T <laughs> He'd been gone for a full 25 minutes. You want to see what I've done in there, he said. Terrifying. I couldn't blame his bowels for their explosive apprehension. This was without doubt one of the most tense situations I had experienced in my working life. So many questions, so few answers. But only one thing was for certain. Those vending machines hadn't vandalised themselves. Professor Burnett paced the room, simultaneously giving off the impression of someone with immense authority, but also someone needing a, a wee. <laughs> <laughs> Who did this? He boomed, his loud voice physically hurting my ears. Who did this and why? A silence followed before a figure stepped forward from the shadows. I did it, you t <laughs> It was Jeff Stelling, now known as the star of Sky Sports Football Countdown, but then just another aspiring newsreader with dreams of the big time. I did it, and I'd do it again. Now, if you don't mind, I'm going to eat my lion bar in peace. He walked out the door, slamming it behind him before returning to fetch his briefcase and loafers. What a guy.